So our uh, next portion, we're really going to delve into uh, the building design is what we're going to talk about. And so what we want to give you guys an idea of is really what is it about um, the building design that will affect your eco roof? Because I don't want, we're not going to go into everything there is to know about building design because then you'd get a degree in architecture, or structural engineering when we're done with this. But um, or what is it about your eco roof design that will affect the building structure? Because hopefully some of those times you're going to get out a little bit ahead of that building um, uh, design and be able to influence where the roof is going to slope, um, where drains are going to be, what the aspect and those kinds of things. So that's really what we're going to talk a little bit about today. Um, <clears throat> So the eco roof again is uh, this lightweight system of soil, growing meteor substrate, uh, and vegetation, which has been designed to be as self-sustaining as possible. <clears throat> There's lots of different soil substrates um, or soil mixes that have been used across Portland. Um, they all have varying weights. Um, <clears throat> excuse me, um, but in general, we've been looking at that four to six inches in thickness and what we say is kind of a lightweight soil, soil media. So that will, that's what we'll be talking about today. 